Happy Guru Rinpoche Day to my old Dharma brothers and sisters, uh, wherever you are. Today I'd like to <coughs> read a very nice uh, uh, a writing by a great master, name is Padu Rinpoche, and I thought it's very uh, clear to me, and that, that this one actually poster is uh, in the our uh, center in uh, Singapore, Rangjung Yishi Udayana Center in Singapore. So, uh, what I wanted to say is, Paru Rinpoche actually uh, mentions things that uh, what we actually missing in life, and I just want to say that many of us, um, as you know, we we try to practice and we try to do this, and I I think it's very important to have a clear idea of what is the uh, wrong qualities that we have in life and how they are actually uh, nature, the nature or of our wrong uh, thoughts and emotions. So, for example, the first one say, Ngajal Chien La means the proud will never be pleased. So, when you when you be a, when you are proud, when other people are proud, cannot be pleased easily. You cannot please them easily. So, you are being very proud. Always you have a difficult to please, and because of your proud, it's always difficult to uh, fulfill things, and your expectations are high, and you take very personally. I like to advise all of you: please uh, be aware that uh, don't take too much of personal things, and don't don't take too much of proud, and uh, it's uh, very healthy. And uh, it's very important to be aware in daily life things because you can see much more clearer in daily lives. Tado jela kudume means the jealous the jealousy will never be happy. So when you have a jealousy, a person you have a lot of jealous in life towards others. You you going to find a very difficult to uh, have a moment of happiness because you always your mind is jealous and I think it's very important to have sometimes competition mind to able to improve things to uh, change things to in, you know to be get better in life but jealousy always gives you uh, unhappiness and unsatisfying things in life so jealousy is not so healthy in normally. And means the greedy will never be satisfied. So the person who is a very greedy or very attachment person who is very attached to things, you you're going to have very difficult to have satisfied in life. And especially when you have too much attachment and greedy to things that what you have, what you want to have, never enough. So when you're not enough, meaning to satisfy, life is always uh, uh, you have subtle complaining in life. It's so always you have uh, 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 how you say never in uh, not enough, and always you feel uh, not wealthy. Uh, not not fully uh, not fully things that you have, you you not going to be so happy. Always you missing something. You want to have more. So it's very true. The greedy will never be satisfied. So you need to learn to be satisfied. You need, need to learn to remind yourself that you are very happy that what you have. You need to be respect and uh, you know be uh, how you say uh, satisfied things in life. And you need to remind towards yourself. It's very healthy. Shedang chen la tundu means mean hateful never be uh, reconciled. Mean that hateful person or angry person is very difficult to reconcile. To, to be actually how you say difficult to make friendship or dif difficult to reconcile or forgive or forget. And asking uh, you know forgiveness is very difficult to forgive you. And that kind of things is very difficult because you are very person, very angry and very uh, hated person. So that's why the head will never be uh, reconciled. So you need to watch your hatred to slowly to remember to let go and kind of uh, make yourself easy to reconcile or you need to give us some space to yourself and others. That is can be for anyone, your towards yourself, towards your family members, Sangha members, Dharma brothers and sisters your friends, colleagues and bosses and any other people is very important to keep in mind. Senna Chenla Yudu means that the stingy will never ha have enough. 
the stingy will never have enough. So you're very stingy. You you never enough things. You always uh, worst part is you always feel more stingy, and stingy always uh, makes you uh, more uh, uh, how you say uh, difficult to give. You never respect of giving. The stingy never have enough uh, for yourself, and you cannot give others. So stinginess is uh, very difficult, especially when it comes to supporting your families, friends, and dharma activities helping to other people who really need needy yes there's always you need to watch your stinginess so what i wanted to say in guru Rinpoche day that please you know all of you whoever practicing dharma whoever wanting to practice dharma all of you please watch all these kind of neg- uh, thoughts and emotions and the things that we do in normally so the stingy will never have enough the last one timukjana dubdume means ignorant will never accomplish ignorant will never accomplish meaning the person who have a lot of ignorant ignorant means not uh, being clear in life not seeing clear not understanding clear that kind of person never have in uh, not never accomplish because you don't see things in life uh, clearly so that's why you cannot achieve things in you now in nicely so you need to be very clear in life especially in a spiritual life and when you have a path in spiritual very important to see clear when you don't see clear what is spiritual path means what is your life about what are you going to do this kind of you don't have no clear you you know you have a lot of ignorance or you not have a lot of blind spots or not seeing clear you, you never accomplish things in life and dharma or non-dharma or spiritual or no spiritual so basically i want to repeat parurin Bhutji actually said the proud will never be pleased Jealousy will never be happy. The greedy will never be satisfied. The hateful never be reconciled. The stingy will never have enough. The ignorant will never accomplish. So this is things is very important uh, to remember. And all of you, I'm sending many my love and prayers to all of you. And uh, take care. Uh, and help other people how much you can please practice don't be too uh, excuses too much and uh, take care and uh, bye bye